Salutations, and welcome to Kirby Plays Games. This is Seven Days to Die, and we are back for Day 12 of the Snow Biome Survival Series. We have a busy day planned ahead of us, and our first stop is some early morning looting. Looks like we're going the rest of the way on foot. Now the reason we're climbing this mountain is somewhere around here there is a ranger's outpost. And I know that those have gun safes, so I would like to pilfer that if possible. Oops. <laughs> At least it's just a sprain. Dangers of mountaineering. Try to be careful. Looks like we have located our objective. <laughs> Probably didn't have to climb over the mountain, but here we are. And already we've got some interesting customers to deal with. Start out with a perimeter check and some animal control it looks like. Huh. Okay. Sure. Whoa! Whew! That was close. I don't know if that lumberjack's gonna bother us. Let's make sure he doesn't. I don't think there's any way to do this stealthy. Hmm, doesn't seem to be anyone upstairs. Is it possible there's no one in here? Oh my gosh, I've never seen this POI empty. That's weird, I, I can't imagine why this is empty. Okay. Yeah, so we'll loot the, ooh, what? Oh, from a kitchen sink. That is a good find. Grandpa's learning elixir, yes please. Ridiculous amount of cooking pots. Great. Sounds like someone wants to interrupt our fun. Awesome. Hopefully our four lock picks will be enough. A great success. Ooh, scope mod. Neat. You know, our inventory is looking pretty reasonable. 
And we might as well loot this place too. Hazmat? Been unexpected? Because the trader is sort of on the way back, we're going to head to the trader. And I've decided to break down and buy the puffer coat before the inventory switches over. Because the cold is real. And it's really affecting the rate we're consuming food. And just uh, the overall ability to do stuff in the game, quite honestly. Nice bookcase. And that's how you do a beatdown. Nice. We're still gonna clear then loot. He heard us. Huh. Nope. That is an interesting movement strategy. Yeah, swim through the air, bud. And now they're going back to do it all again. Awesome. Let's see what's up here. Anyone else? Nope. Grab the spear. I guess we can take this place apart too. not bad. Nice little secret there. Not very useful. Of course there's something behind the picture frame. Lots of bookcases in this place. Ooh. Very nice. Very nice. That's a great bookcase. Might as well use this while we're at it. Nice! New wrench. Not bad, not bad at all. I feel like there's a reasonable chance. Yep. Nice. Anything else up here? I think that's it. We are super encumbered. We're gonna take our bicycle and be on our way to the trader, where I will get my puffy, puffy coat. Even found some grenades and all of that, huh? That's what we're after right there. Look at that cold resist. <laughs> but he's like real surprised that the uh, winter jacket is selling so well. So now that we've got an awesome jacket, we are going to head home, unpack our stuff, and then I think I want to, even before we go back outside, there is something I want to check. I believe that I can now grab a cement mixer and a workbench. That's great. Okay. Let's see. What do we need for that? Cement. Mixer requires a workbench. So workbench is our first thing. Workbench. We'll have to use our other hammer to craft a workbench, so we might as well craft a replacement hammer. We are going to need a lot of iron for all of the things that we want to create. 
And so definitely not a bad time to get the iron mine started. The next Horrid Night is not far off. So we definitely need to have some preparations in place for day 14. coal in here as well. That's super convenient. Yeah, that's not bad at all. I think we can call that a successful day in general. Raided two buildings, got a very cool coat. So, that's gonna be it for this episode. I think I'm gonna do some work on the roof and probably look at getting a cement mixer going for tomorrow. So, that being said, thank you very much for joining me for this episode. If you enjoyed it, please do consider liking and subscribing, and most importantly, have an excellent day.